Pleasant morning children happy to see you all again today we are going to discuss the book back exercise of body movements first it is fill in the blanks first question joints of the bone help in the dash of the body our body undergoes lot of process with the help of the bone what process can be done that is answer for first question second question a combination of bones and cartilage forms dash of the body so our body have lot of systems like circulatory system respiratory system excretory system digestive system so lot of system is there but here the combination of bones and cartilage what system they form think it and write it here third question the bones at the elbow are joined by the joint called so the elbow bone okay so elbows are joined by the joint call what is the kind of joint we have learned about four types of joint ball and socket joint pivotal joint hind joint and fixed joint so among this four one is the right answer think wisely and write it fourth question the contraction of the dash pulls the bone during the movement so while we are moving something is get contracted in our body what is that that is the answer for this question next we are going to discuss the true or false first question movement and locomotion of animals is exactly the same so if you see the birds fishes human beings and insect so all living things and the animals whether they have same kind of movement think wisely and write the answer second question the cartilages are harder than bones cartilage where it is present you know the best example that it is ear bone right so whether it is harder than bones check it off and write the correct answer third question the finger bones do not have joints we know that with the help of the joints we can able to bend and we can make a movement there right so here they have given that finger bones do not have joints so think whether it is true or false and write the right answer fourth question the forearms has two bones first you have to be very clear what is forearm and hind joint okay so forearm it is two bones so think wisely and write the answer final question cockroach have an outer skeleton we have learned about the cockroaches so whether they have the outer skeleton or not think wisely and write next it is match the following so two columns it is given here i am read outing the first column upper jaw fish ribs snail cockroach and second column you have to match these two columns okay i am reading the options in second column have fins on the body so it is related to fish has an outer skeleton obviously it is related to cockroach can fly in the air it is related to birds is an immovable joint which is a fixed joint okay protects the heart so it is role of the particular bone shows very slow movement so it is an animal we have learned have a streamlined body so which animal will have the streamlined body so here if you see the column one can have the two answers also okay so don't get confused and write the correct answer fourth question this three questions you have to write in your class work note the first question what is the ball and socket joint so you know the structure of the ball and socket joint so by the name we can able to identify what is the shape okay and you have to mention here what is the shape and how it is used and what are the movements they can do okay and second question which of the skull bones are movable so we have learned about skull skull it is actually the fixed joint but only one joint we can able to move so write that name of that joint okay second third question why can our elbow do not move backwards so we know that our elbow it is made up of particular joint which can able to move 
only one direction okay our elbow it is towards the forward not in the backward direction okay so mention that and also mention where the other um, particular joint it is uh, present and which can able to move backward not in the frontward okay so complete all these book back questions we will meet in the next session thank you children